I've got my hands on some Dokkan Battle trading cards, thanks to Greg Dorr, link in description. And whatever cards I draw from here, I'm gonna use in a team in the real Dokkan Battle. I'm not really looking at the cards, I don't know what I'm gonna get. And we get... Oh, okay, so, so a support memory first. We'll put it over there, and uh, we'll try out the next card here. Okay, Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta. Cool. We really like that. We have to shuffle the deck again. Not too bad so far. And we get... Ooh! Holographic Super Saiyan 4s? I'm liking it! So far we've got a good giant 8 power team of sorts, if you want to call it that. Shuffle the deck again. And not looking, not looking... Ah, the ALR Gods! Nice! Got a good 7th anniversary style team going on so far. Alright, put it back down, shuffle it again. Not looking. Ah! Well, that's gonna be useful. <laughs> Vegeta and Trunks, very good. So that's 4 out of 6 so far. Ah, we already got the holographic. We got 2 holographics, but we already have Gogeta or the Super Saiyan 4 is there. So we'll put that one aside and we'll just shuffle again. Alright, put it back down. Not looking, not looking. Hey, the Super Saiyan Duos. They're actually pretty underrated in my opinion. Can't, can't hate them. Place it back down. And pick it up again. Not looking. And we get the Beast. Okay. Um, I can definitely make this work. I'll have to put that aside. I'll, I'll definitely give it my best shot. I mean, it's not the most optimal team in the world. But <laughs> for a start, we'll see how it goes. Alrighty, so the team we've got here is, yeah, it's an alright team, but uh, unfortunately the Super Saiyan duo isn't included in the leader skill, so they're gonna be a little goofy. I might have to switch them up with somebody who was in the Dokkan trading cards later, but we'll, we'll, we'll deal with that when it comes to it. Let's do this first round of the... Um, Red Zone Broly event. Two seconds later. All right, so we've got a modest, around 700k health, not too bad. I think we'll just start off immediately like this. We're gonna have to float the duo. I feel like they get, they're gonna mess up the run, I, I think. <laughs> this is not gonna end well. Yeah, I can already tell we're, we're, we're not going very far in this run. Now we just have to wait for Greg to make more cards. The more cards, the better. At least we're stacking defense so far, it's not bad. Oh, look at that damage, guys. Don't we love it? Oh, at least they did get the super attack. A measly 600k, and of course he'd super attack them. Because why wouldn't he? Yeah, not, not as much damage as I thought it'd take. Oh my god, the least time. You're not going to be defeating anyone, mate, I'm sorry. I'm just struggling to understand what they were thinking with this ultimate Gohan. I mean, seriously. Oh yeah, and I took a modified version of the SSJ4s. Private server shenanigans, you know what's up. This is canon. This is also canon. Well, half canon. And that's the run. <laughs> well, that went well. Are right, we gonna switch things up and actually have somebody else that was in the dog hunt trading cards? Okay, now hopefully we should be good. There we go. Look at that health increase. Almost 800k now. And I forgot to turn off entrance animations. No, dog. This is madness. It's funny because like the SSJ4 duo kind of already do need an easy A. Well, not really, but like it, it wouldn't hurt, you know? And Tech Broly happens to show up. All right. We've got the 24 key with Gohan. So I think this should be fine. This should be a super effective attack. So far, so good. We're blitzing through this second round. So that's Tech Broly. We're moving on to the AoE phase. 
Solid 5 million damage there. And from Vegeta... Eh, 2.7. It's annoying though, I had to pick the one unit that wasn't in Bond of Parent and Child or Future Saga. Just the one unit from the trading cards. Alright, here's the final phase. Let's use that active skill. Gogeta's showing up. Uh, Defense-wise, I'm thinking Gogeta might actually be all good to go there. Full key for Gohan. And... Hmm... Let's see if 400k defense is enough for Broly here. 69, funny number. Okay, solid 9 million attack stat there. Very nice. And the casual 13.5 million from Gohan. I take it back, he's not least time. He's on that beast time action. And some solid defense too. Love to see it. <laughs> <laughs> he actually nullified Broly's attack. That's too good, that is. That's way too good. I think he is him. To be honest, I think he is him. Wait, how much damage were they? No, not much damage at all. Very solid turn there. I didn't need to use the Ghost Star Shun. Here's the LR Gods. Showing up. Uh, now I think is a good time to use it. Just because... I just remembered you can't dodge in these phases so better safe than sorry all right 6.9 million another funny number it's full of funny numbers this round get the additional attack here beautifully animated super attack if i say so myself Ten million from Goku here. They really did a good job with these easy eggs. Like honestly, people hate on them, but still very solid. Like consistent nine million, ten million, and these aren't modified in any way. Well, except for Gogeta, but he he doesn't count. All right, let's see if Gogeta ends it or if the Beast Han will. Eight million here. I I think it's Beast Han's turn to end things off. I'm gonna actually use. The active skill here. Let's watch it in full glorious mode. Japanese dub, of course. It looks good. The PNG action is real. He is him. And there you go. Under 10 minutes there. Not too shabby if I say so myself, this little trading card run, if you want to call it that. But yeah, that was that. Let me know if you want me to do more of these sorts of things. I'm quite happy to do them. Uh, shout out to Greg Dorr for the trading cards. And you all take care of yourselves. Have a good one.